What's happening people? Hope you like that intro. Just playing out a little bit, trying to make it a bit more fun and interesting for you all. Right now I'm about to drive to Leeds. I'm in Liverpool at the moment. I've got all the stuff that I'm taking to uni. So I'll see you when I get there. It's gonna take me about one hour thirty minutes. So yeah, I'll see you when I'm there. Update, just arrived in Leeds now. You probably can't even tell because I'm sitting in the car. But yeah, by the way, I forgot to mention, I filled this up all the way to the top. It's one litre, as you can see on the markings there. And now it's down to about 300. So yeah, I've drank about 700 millilitres of water. So I'm absolutely dying for the loo. So I'll catch it when I'm inside the house. So here we are in the new house. This is the kitchen. This is what I'm going to be doing all my prepping in over the next year. We've even got the scale out all ready to go. I've got my tripod there. That's definitely going to come in handy. This is the sort of little living area that we've got. By the way, there's three of us living in this house. So as you can see, it's a decent amount of space. Got the TV there. Going up to the first floor. This is going to be my room. So just going up the stairs here. It's a little bit dark, but yeah. This is my room on the left here. Bathroom ahead there. My other mate, his room is upstairs. So that's the bathroom in there. We've got here, it's a little bit messy now because I've only just moved a few bits in. We've got a mirror there. Two nice big windows. Bed there and another wardrobe over there in addition to this one here. So going back downstairs. We've got my other mate's room in the basement. So as you can see, there's actually a decent amount of space for three people. I think we've got a really good deal here. Um, it's just looking a little bit bare at the moment. I definitely need to get some stuff on my walls, get all stuff moved over into here from my house. But yeah, right now I'm gonna get breakfast. I'm gonna go to the shop quickly, get food for the day. So I'll show you when I get to the shop. So here's all the food that I just bought in the shop then. I couldn't quite get everything that I wanted, so I'm gonna be going to a different shop later to get a few extras. So that's gonna be frozen berries and dark chocolate, but I did get pretty much all the ingredients. So here we've got the meats, we've got the lean beef mince, we've got chicken breast, and then we've got the green veg in the middle. So we've got spinach, broccoli, lettuce, and then we've got the carb sauces at the back. Um, I'll catch it at the first meal of the day when I'm cooking breakfast. So here we have it. it, is the first meal of the day. We've got two whole eggs, two egg whites, one slice of toast and a handful of spinach. Also got a black coffee to go with it. I'll be having this meal quite late. I'm having it at 10 a.m. Typically I'll be having this at about seven or eight in the morning, but all that means is I'm gonna have a pre-workout meal after this, which I'll show you in a bit, and then I'll train, but then I'll just be having the meals that I would have had before, after I train. I'll show you the rest through the day. Also, just want to say the calories and macros for that meal are just up on the screen now. I'll be using my fitness pal throughout the whole day. I've just found it so easy recently to track all my meals on that. So basically what I'm doing is I click on create a meal and then I'll just input all the ingredients I need throughout the day for those meals. And then when I'm ready to put it into my fitness pal, I'll click it and I'm ready to go. No need to insert loads and loads of different ingredients. I'm just ready to go on that meal. front of us we've got the pre-workout meal what that is is a pit of bread i've actually destroyed it there something i really find hard is being able to cut a pit of bread open evenly if anyone has any tips please let me know we've got 150 grams of chicken 
and iceberg lettuce in that. And then we've got two rice cakes with 10 grams of peanut butter on. I've actually just run out of peanut butter then. So when I go to the shops later, I'll make sure to grab some of that. And then as you saw in the intro, we've got the Monster Ultra. I'll be having this with a little bit of pre-workout. I know I probably shouldn't as it's too much, but uh, YOLO. So yeah, let's get to the gym. session then gonna quickly go and jump in the posing room and have a quick 10-15 minutes after the session I'll show you when I'm in there to nip to the shops quickly to grab a few bits for the post-workout meal luckily the shop's only at the bottom of the road so it's not going to delay the meal for too long
gonna talk into this now. I'll put the calories and macros up on the screen for you there, but I'm not gonna wait any longer because I'm so starving. Let's dig in. Also, just wanted to share with you all, this is the crazy pre-workout stack that you saw in my intro. What we've got is we've got the Chaos Crew Stim and Pump. And combined with that, we had the ABE by Applied Nutrition. All the great pre-workouts and combined together is a lethal combination, especially with that monster. Back with the fourth meal of the day, we've got chicken, we've got brown rice and we've got broccoli. I'll put the macros and calories up for you on the screen now. We're also having a green tea to go with that. Um, and what I like to do is I've cooked all this food now. So I've cooked the next two chicken, rice and broccoli meals for the next two days now. It just saves time. It's so much easier. That's going to be my meal for later on today. Um, that's just beef mints, green beans, and then we're going to have some potatoes to go with that. So, yeah, um, but that's it for this meal. I'll catch you at meal five. What's happening everyone? Just went over to me mates then. I'm walking back now. I had my fifth meal of the day over there. The macros for that meal are up on the screen now. Um, I'll catch you back home when I'm having the sixth meal of the day. So yeah, I'll see you then. What's going on everyone? This is the final meal of the day. The macros and calories are up for you on the screen now. I'm also gonna be having 20 grams of dark chocolate to go with it. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed my full day of eating and going to the gym. Stay lean everyone.